Welcome to the introduction of Schema Manager. Schema Manager is a tool to support multi-tenancy inside KubeDB. Multi-tenancy is a reference to the mode of operation of software where multiple independent instances of one or multiple applications operate in a shared environment. Uh, the instances are logically separated but physically integrated. Let's say I have three developers in my company and I have to provision some database servers for them uh, where they can build their own databases and run operations. What I can do is get three different servers and I assign one to each of them, give them admin access and so on. But this is not an efficient solution. Rather, it would be better if we can just um, use a single database server to serve that purpose. And at this point, the concept of multi-tenancy comes in. While implementing multi-tenancy, our goal is to create a logical separation inside the server and also secure them. To implement multi-tenancy inside KubeDB, we have developed Schema Manager. Schema Manager uses Cube Vault under the hood to implement the features, give them proper security, and reduce the blast radius in case of credential leakage. In this feature, the whole flow is something, the whole flow is something like this. The main database server provisioner would mention some criteria for namespaces while creation. And the user may only be able to apply schema YAML from those permitted namespaces only. In schema YAML, uh, the user must mention a database name, uh, which will eventually be created uh, for him. And also he can mention the configuration he wants for the database like character set, encryption, uh, read-only mode, or collation and user should also also mention the subjects uh, to whom the credentials would be exposed and also the validation timeout is configurable and our operator also allows user to initialize the database with sql script and restore database from the snapshots